What is going on to the zero people watching this? Y'all ready for some bullshit? Cause I am. But it's hard to say that it actually is bullshit because we just won our third Stanley Cup in a row. And I'm not sure if we have a first rounder this year. Fuck the draft from the views. We're gonna get right to it. No, no, I don't want to trade. Because Ottawa wants to trade that 13th pick. I swear we had a second round pick from Calgary. Huh. Anyways. We're going to make our pick here. Do we go with the top four offensive defense? And yeah. Oh, we got some top six, but they're on it. Oh, man. All of that. Where's this guy? Dmitry Bobrovsky. We're gonna go with him, guys. Oh man, what was he? Please, please, please. Top nine. Oh no. And then, <laughs> but he's a grinder. So if we go to the ninety-third pick, let's see what is left here. Another per oh my god, Jacob goalie, and he's a goalie. I mean, come on, dude. Do we go for Marcus Bushkarev or the guy? I'm going with the goalie, dude. The goalie named goalie, and is it a good pick? Fringe starter, not really. Uh, Fourth round pick. This guy's still available. We're going to pick him right away. And he wasn't much, but whatever. At this point in the draft, you, you don't really care, right? So. Well, I don't. Uh, they're telling me to go with De Silva, so. Let's get it. Now. Let's see what he was. And he's a gem. Ooh, a top six medium power forward. He was low-key a gem. Okay, medium top six. That's good. I like that. Um, Felix Petterman, why not give him a shot? It's the fifth round, right? So, top nine low. All right, and... Oh, wait, wait, what? No, I think we're out of picks here. And I'm okay with that. Um, <laughs> wait, what the fuck? Oh my god, why? Why can't I pick the right option here? This is what I want to do. I'm going to slow it right down. Sim options. Sim entire draft. There we go. <laughs> fuck, man. Anyways. We took a chance on Bobrovsky. It turned out to be a top nine. I mean... Resign coaches. I mean, we might as well keep Conacher. He's been good for us, right? And he just won, uh, won three Stanley Cups with us. We're going to just resign everybody, keep the team. Kind of exactly how it is. There we go. 
பாக்கம் all right can't even check what we have till uh this is over i mean i have room for him but then there's no room for anyone else we're gonna qualify <laughs> as an rfa and we're gonna try to get captain in no we're not getting captain in back i'm just gonna release him right away Burkowski, we might be able to get him back at, uh, fuck. Everyone wants to make so much money, right? So, sure your ankle is here, how much he wants. Uh, one year at 1.6, how about that? They qualify him. Actually, we shouldn't qualify them because then they make more than I actually want them to. And we get two more years, why not? Be a depth guy. Version. All right, we're gonna fucking advance there. Uh, I have no clue whether um, I don't know if we got the coach or not here. We'll try giving him three years at eight point four million dollars. Why not? There we go. So we got like no cap space to sign anyone. Um fuck. Uh, we're gonna re-sign people here. Uh, I got everything I need. Okay, man. So I'm gonna have to actually see what I need. Uh, go in here to see that. And let's fucking see. We're ready. So we got our four centers. We got three wingers there. Almost no wingers. Um, so we're going to have to get rid of uh, Gerard, to be honest. Um, 
Hmm, let's see. They don't really have anybody. No, not of our interest. Huh. Here, we'll go forwards in general. Or we'll just go... Yeah, no, we'll go forwards. Huh. How about this? We'll go find a trade for Gerard. Uh, find trade. Unfortunately, it has... Like, I don't know. We could get rid of Byram. We'll see what we could get for Byram and Gerard. Hmm. Oh, wrong button again. Because Byron does get injured a lot more. He's got more value. I don't know. Like, to trade Byron, though, it's just like we gotta get a big return. Here, we'll try Vegas. This pick and then guy, 84 at 20 years old. Our next two second rounders and a random seventh, because why not? Just the chip in. So this is the deal, man. Byron and three picks for their... Mm. We'll give you another second rounder. Three second rounders for this picking a guy. And we're going to have to re-sign him next year. So I actually don't think that's a good idea at all. Anyways, we're going to go to Vancouver and see what they have for forwards. We need some wingers. No way we're touching these guys. Um, Sanford, oh man. I don't know. About that. <clears throat> no one wants to get rid of the good players, right? So we're going to have to kind of force a trade. Gensel's getting paid way too much. Uh, that's another guy that's an RFA. Trade for Petrolane and, and sign him to what we want, pretty much. Um, I'll even give you fucking more cap to take, if you will. Um...
How about this? I'll give you my second this year. I'll give you my first this year and my second next year. How about that? And how about fuck the... Look at that. Look at that value. Petra Layman. Also get a third rounder from you. And they accept it. So Bone Byram's on his way to Ottawa. Meanwhile, we get this guy. So instead of signing a free agent, we get to sign um, an RFA here. Petra Lanen. And we don't have enough money to sign him. Two years at $6.6 .6 million. That we needed. There we go. So, honestly, we're just going to send to next season. Get this off season over with. Anderson accepts. Fuck it, anything to get rid of some cap at this point. We're going to just accept those trades. Uh, no thanks. You don't want more cap. Uh, actually, hold on. If we go to rookie, I didn't sign that to Silva guy. So we have like zero to no cap. It'd be crazy if this team could get it done one more time, eh? Mm-mm. I don't want to get rid of Hogson. That's what's up. Where's Fetov? He's going to help us here this year. They're going to be our bottom forwards. They're not 80 overalls or whatever, but... They're fucking good, right? And 74s or whatever. I see some other options. So we... Now, let's just see... What the fuck? This, uh... We'll set captains, make sure we have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So right away, add the lines. You know, we gotta go to the Russia moves. Do some shit. Uh, Russia moves. Um... Best lines for now. So, why did Yos go down? Oh, buddy, but a plus three here gets them back up. Gets everyone a plus one. Foxen's up there, too. Uh,. I'd rather that. So we got an 80, an 83, and a 79. An 83, an 85, and an 83. 88, 91, 89. 92, 98, and 95. I'm not Gerard or Makar. How? Yes. They still play at plus three. I mean, at this point, is that worth it just to get that plus three? It's stupid that it doesn't apply to the second line. But, like, I don't know.
I don't know if that's what we should do. I think whatever, right? Anyway, special teams. Ooh. We're going to put uh, Gerard and Smith on the point here. Smith. there so i went silent for a while i was really focusing on these lines here okay extra tech or whatever uh like that anyway done and let's get this season on the roll. So I really hope our new defensive core carries us through the year. Unfortunately, we have to get rid of Byron to make room for the cap. Um, we had a chance to get rid of a bit more cap. I can't. Speak tell us part of that trade. Oh man, here we go. First game with the new team against the Winnipeg fucking Jets. Y'all ready to fuck this team up? I swear if we lose. Fuck you, Winnipeg. We've taken you out so many times. We're not worried. 2-2 two, two after one. Karpastev. Karpastev. 
scores his first goal as an avalanche and Petralainen with his first goal as an avalanche. And then Grigorenko, a carpet step again. The D-man. It's like Bufflin that one year. Two goals in his first fucking game as an avalanche. Petralainen helping out. Oh, buddy. Let's go, man. That's that's a big deal for us here. Those guys pitching in right away like that? Fuck yeah. Oh, buddy. Makar and Gerard. Our defenseman. Petra Lane and again and Sammy Blay. Let's go. 4 1 when we're aver averaging four goals a game. Ricard Petra. Three points in two games for us. I haven't seen McKinnon or anything, but that's okay. I know he'll come through. I know Taylor Hall will. One of the con smites last year. There's no way he's going to go fucking only 40 points this year. I will shit bricks. And a 2 1 loss to St. Louis. There we go, boys. So we're going to get to actually simming. Um, okay. Fuck. As I said, Taylor Hall. Fuck, man. <laughs> the game hates me. Oh, no. After three cups, what am I to do? Let's go, boys. Two wins. Big wins, I guess. A shutout and an A2 blowout. And then we get blown out and... Back to back games. Win two, lose two, win two, lose two. You know, it's not a good way. Come on, boys. Fuck. Yes. Eleven four win. Damn, we got firepower if we need it, eh? What the fuck? That second line broke their chemistry. What? What a joke. <laughs> Svitov makes it a plus three, no doubt. Yost and Devorah can't play together neither. Fuck me, dude. So this is what we got for our team, I guess. Fuck it. Svitov helping the team out. Giving us that plus three. He gets to play at an 82 and on the second line. Could you imagine he has a huge fucking year? You know what? I'm going to call it out right now. I'm fucking placing my bets. If Svitov could get a contract extension, I'm going to give him like eight years at a low amount of money and see what goes on here. Svitov, Svitov, Svitov. Eight years at one point. Nine fifty. Win against Calgary in the shootout. And then an OT win over the Kings. And Svitov takes that contract. So I really hope, could you imagine he gets to like an 86 overall and he gives us a plus three and he's an 89 technically. Like, oh man, I really hope we could get like a Ty Smith situation there. Damn, we got some wins right there. Svitov on the second bit of the semi what Svitov has done
Damn, we are getting wins. That's Fitov thing. Oh no, he's injured. Are you kidding me? That's not good. I really hope he comes back soon. He was helping us out there. We're still getting wins. I mean, we just took a 7 5 loss. Still scored 5 goals. So can't be mad at that. Come on, boys. Get that 20th win right here. Yeah. Three straight wins, and then a loss. Damn. Come on, Svitov. We need you in the lineup. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm going to get rid of Markov there. He's not even signed. There we go. Some big wins. 6-1, and then an 8-5 win. And Svitov is back. Mm. Damn. Sorry. Anyways, um, I want to see where your speed of is in points and how many games and all that. Ten points in twenty six games. I mean, could be better, but he is only an eighty two. We're we're pushing it, but uh. Maybe he could pick it up, I don't know. Sim to the deadline. That's just for now. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> and there we go. Nemestikov is back, so we're ready to go. Sorry, Anderson. We have gotten some big fucking wins this year. Let's keep that up. Oh, you have one, Bean. You don't need more. You oh.
We're gonna go with conservative seller. Enter trade de uh, tra trade deadline. Damn, can't talk. Hmm. I don't know what we can use. Yeah, we got nothing they want. I was just gonna see what what we can move around, but it looks like fuck off. Um, so we're just gonna get the fuck out of here. Get one more. He likes Doritos. Sorry about the chip crunching. I just couldn't wait. I needed to. I needed to eat the chips now. Another big one. Seven two. Keeping those prices. They never change here in Colorado. Hell yeah. Our team's actually better than last year, apparently. The Maple Leafs already have 52 wins. And we just got ours. Wow. Two games in a row with seven goals. But I can't talk right now. Shut the fuck up. <clears throat> 55 wins. No. Sammy Blay is out with a sore foot right before the playoffs. Are you fucking joking? Oh, no. We got to play Nashville without Sammy Blay. So, let's see what Nashville has. Wow. 
Well, Only two anyways, two. we're actually going to finish it right here because my girlfriend won't shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to play in Nashville the first round of the playoffs. Uh, they only got 38 wins. We're going to fuck them up, man. We're three times Stanley Cup champions in a row. There's no way we're losing the first round. I hope I didn't just jinx it. Anyways, to the zero people watching this, I love you and I will catch you later.